Alright, so I'm going to show you the hard style kettlebell. Now, the thing that you've got to remember is that kettlebell training is internal. The kettlebell, even though it's outside your body, it's not considered like a dumbbell where it's kind of like external part of your body. You want to try to make it so that the bell is part of your body. And so what you're trying to do is you're trying to move your body around the bell when you do the hard style getup. I'll show you exactly what I mean. With the getup, you'll notice that I'm holding the bell overhead in the vertical position, but I'm just moving my body around the bell and I'm maintaining stability in my shoulders. So this is great for people with shoulder issues like say volleyball players or any athletes, uh, any throwing athletes, any uh, MMA fighters who have bad shoulders, that's another great, uh, another great population that can use kettlebells. So let's get through the get up. So with the get up, you're gonna get down on the floor, in the fetal position, and you're gonna turn over onto your back. And then from here, I'm using my right arm, I'm going to press the bell up and hold it in the ideal position, which is right up over top of my head. Okay, so I'm perfectly aligned. I've got my shoulder, which is packed, so my shoulder is down and back. My lat is higher, and then from here, I'm going to get up onto my elbow. My abs are going to stay on the bell, and then I'm going to get up onto my hand. And I'm opening up, and I'm in good alignment, so that bell's got to stay vertical the whole time. So from here, I'm going to sweep my leg and bring it through. And you'll notice that now I've got a straight line from my foot to my knee, to my hand. So there's a straight line going on through there, and I'm sorry if you're looking at my butt right now, but that's how we gotta do it. All right, so then from here, we're gonna go straight up, and I'm gonna fix myself, and now you'll notice that I'm in a pretty simple half kneeling position, and then from here, I'm standing up. And then we're gonna do the exact same thing getting down. Well, I'll give you another angle so that you can see. So I'm straight up, I'm gonna step back, with my leg, drop my knee down. Now watch my back leg. I'm gonna windshield wiper that leg. And what that does is that allows me to bend at the hip and not at the spine. We wanna really try to keep our spine straight the whole time. I'm gonna sit back, squeeze my shoulder blades and open up. And if you just do this posture here, you'll get a lot of good posture work, a lot of good upper back work. And then I'm gonna sweep my leg through, drop to my elbow, open up my chest, and then back down onto my back. So, the question you might have is, how is that a fat loss exercise? Well, think about this. That's a 45 pound kettlebell weight. But imagine I was using a 53 pound, or a 60 pound, or a 36 K, which is what I have at home that I normally use for get-ups. Then all of a sudden, you're taking that exercise, you're putting a lot of tension on your body. So that took me about maybe 45 seconds to do uh, a full get-up, and I've got all that tension that I'm putting my body under 45 seconds would say a 36 kilogram kettlebell over my head. Now you've got muscle building, you've got fat burning, and you've got strength because your shoulders got to stay strong throughout those positions. So that's exercise number one. 